little blip. All right, we're gonna give it some juice here. Here we go, 80%. Hey, there we go. What is going on, everybody? Welcome back today, guys, to the channel. A set of Corsa. We're back here on the PC today with some more mods. And to be honest with you, I just wanted to drift Fujimi Kaido. This is one of the tracks that I just never really get to play anymore because it's only on a set of course anymore. Uh, nobody really runs it online. I don't have my own server. So it's just kind of right. Think about this track every day, man. Let me know if you guys do down below. And of course, riddle of the day here before we start. This one coming from Lego and Games. And he goes, riddle me this, Batman. What starts with P, ends in an E, and has a bajillion letters in it? A post office. Right? Okay, man. Leave your riddles or dad jokes down below. And of course, don't forget to slap that like button. Here we go. First drive of the day today. We're ripping on Fujimi Kaido. We have our 522 horsepower BMW E92. This thing is so damn clean. Can I follow the car? Oh, I can't. Oh, jeez. Postmaster TSXW. We also have our Sparco uh, sequential gearbox and our Sparco handbrake with the dual setup on there. So that's pretty cool. And then, of course, our uh, Thrustmaster TLCM pedals and our next level racing rig. Here we go. Now, we've actually changed cars here. We grabbed the Holden Commodore. Man, I didn't even see this before we started. I had to grab this. We're going to see how we do with this thing. Haven't been on Fujimi Kaido in so long, man. Am I going to be able to drift this whole thing? Probably not. Am I going to give it a damn hardest shot? Of course, man. We're going to try our best. The Thrustmaster TSXW out as well, too, here. Dirt. A little bit of hook view. Sounds pretty mean. Oh, come on out. Yeah, I don't know. I'm feeling this hood be a little bit more. I'm going to see if we can put down a functional lap. Oh. But, but again, though, I'm right. I mean, I don't know if I'm the only one who has memories on Fujimi Kaido or not. But if I'm not, let me know in the comment section down below. But I met a lot of close friends from this track and just late night sessions, hitting up the online servers and just running a little toge, right? Mike's on, hey, what's up, man? Nice car, nice build. Hey, you wanna throw a friend invite on me? Yeah, man, we're gonna do a drift lobby tomorrow night, hop on in, boom. You got a friend for life almost, man, right? So, oh, gee, too much. It will fare nicely though once we get up to the top of the hill and then we can kind of uh, swing the whole weight of it downhill. Here we go. Look at that mountain off in the distance, that's crazy. I did another episode on this track, which was pretty cool. I think my first impressions of the uh, 2020 for Jimmy Kaido. And uh, just since then, I've wanted to play it. And like I said, there's no online servers with it. And I wish that there was. I don't know why there's not. But now, if you guys also were watching F1 over the weekend, pretty crazy finish there for Lewis Hamilton. Uh, honestly, Verstappen just kind of gave it to him after he kind of let him right by on the straight. I felt like he definitely could have done a better job holding him a little bit closer and letting him in as well for that penalty but it was it was crazy it was my first time actually watching it from start to finish 110 percent will be back to watch another f1 event and i'm glad that i caught the season opener so i can keep on watching it but i definitely enjoyed it let me know your thoughts down below if you guys are watching it who you guys are rooting for and uh who you think's pulling away world champion this year i think it's what lewis hamilton's going for number nine or number seven or something like that maybe it's the tom brady of f1 it's pretty crazy i'm excited to just keep following it I think it's going to be pretty cool, man. I was watching The Drive to Survive on Netflix. Kind of just got me more excited into, you know, F1. And it's glad that uh, that's been on there to kind of open the eyes a little bit more to people on F1. And uh, it's it's a pretty exciting sport, man. I'm, I'm really excited that I got back into it. I'm just excited I kind of uh, finally sat down and watched the full race. Oh. I think we're, yeah, we are going to bring this down quite a bit because it seems like we're clipping. I know everybody in the comments, slap man, you're clipping. Now, I just like high force feedback, right? <laughs> oh, I just tapped both of them a little bit too hard, probably. And fourth gear. That fourth gear is not bad. Yeah, I definitely do not recommend that E92 in that pack. I definitely recommend this over that for sure. But I mean, obviously, tuning plays a big pack. Right, a big factor and I didn't really tune too much of that car I mean all these are starting off with comp tires I don't know why probably the weirdest thing I've ever seen hold that yeah 
coming around. Ooh, we clipped it again. Let's see how we do. Starting off our downhill. It was nice and easy. Trying to just rack up the points right now. Just imagine us on Forza Motorsport 4. You have to imagine for today. There's no drift points. <laughs> right? Just hear the ticking going on. Maybe I can get a little timer going or something like that. I feel like at this point, though, since the track isn't in Forza, it's got to be a licensing deal. But then, you know, I'm thinking, this isn't even a real thing, so... It can't be a licensing issue. Could it be just they don't want to put it in? I mean, I... I don't know. Oh, boy. Try that out. Here we go. No turbo. Ooh. Yep, 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 yep. I'll take it. A little bit more enforced feedback here. I like my uh, my tight steering. I thought for sure we were gonna peg that wall there. I think we're good. Yeah, we were so close to the tire marks. Oh man. Go, go, no. Right, part of me wants to go back and do this over again. Is there a map? I don't even think there is a map, is there? Oh, there is a track map. I'm tossing this thing on. Also too, four o'clock today, maybe. We are going to see a little F1, but on the mobile device. I just seen that on the App Store after today's race. Had to pick it up. Haven't played it yet. I'm curious to see how it's going to be. And if you guys have the F1 on mobile, let me know your thoughts. It's made by Codemaster, so it's got to be good. Oh, jeez, sorry. We're okay. Just a tap. Turn around a bit, yeah. Just letting her swing. Oh, too much swing. Let's try a little third person again here. Oh, yeah. Oh, we got air on that there. Front wheels just hopped. Let's take this nice and easy. Fourth gear working with no damn turbo. Oh, shit. Just tapping it. No, we're okay. Woo. Little blip. Right, we're going to give it some juice here. Here we go. 80%. Hey, there we go. Get that angle. Just need a little juice, man. Just pump it up a bit. Another swing. Fourth gear. Come on now, holder. Yeah, there we go. A little reverse entry in third person. That's sick. I love this view. I'm a huge fan of this view. These mountains look very impressive here. Holy shit. Oh, yeah. One more time. Hopefully here if we can. Oh, gee. Now, I didn't actually see where the next race is being held for F1. If you guys know, let me know in the comment section down below. Because I will be uh, starting a series back up this week on that same race. So I'm going to actually start following the F1 as they're doing it. And uh, put out my video uh, probably on the Sunday. My GoPro just died? Are you kidding me? Hey! Come back, right? What the hell? Okay, there, there we go. Had to click it on. Right at the most vital spot right here. Huge entry. Chairs moving. We got the next level racing ring hooked up as well too for the motion. I'm just going to plow right through this, yeah. Terrible decision. Here we go. Big. Ooh, yeah. I got it. Another big one. Uh, yeah, swing me. Ooh. Here we go. Have to correct it just a bit. Not bad, man. We didn't really do too much. I just did the tires on here. A little bit of rear camber. And we're good to go. I need to get online, man. I need to run some tandems. I also have the VR set up as well, too. If you guys would like to see that, let me know down below. A little uh, Fujimi Kaido in VR? I just thought of that. Okay. Maybe next episode, right? If you guys want to see it, let me know down below in the comment section. We are just tapping the shit out of this thing. Help me. Oh, right, did we uh, relive Fujimi Kaido enough? I think, uh, right, I think I'm okay for a little bit longer. 
hopefully not too much longer, Forza, right? I need this back in the game ASAP. Appreciate it. Let me know your thoughts down below, and I'll see you guys back here for yet another episode on the channel, man. I'm out. Peace.